Smallholder women farmers in Nigeria's capital, Abuja, have expressed concern over the delay in assenting to the Federal Capital Territory Administration's annual budget and seek urgent intervention from the relevant body. They expressed worry over the delay and poor allocations of funds for agriculture in the FCT, which they say has persisted for more than three years. The Assistant Secretary of the Association, FCT, added that the delay has impacted their livelihood and initiatives aimed at enhancing food production, thus resulting in a high cost of food in the FCT. The delayed fund has hindered the implementation of training programs, information, extension services, and, and, and market access initiatives, which are crucial for enhancing productivity and income generation from these farmers and increase economic development for FCT and the nation at large. Consequently, the implication of this uh, lamentable delay and untimely FCT agricultural appropriation bill indicates increased, increased prices of, good, of food items in FCT while perpetuating a circle of low productivity, poverty, food insecurity, and inequality with direct impact with direct, which directly impacts the well-being and development of rural communities. While applauding governments and other stakeholders for their continuous support to over a million small-scale women farmers across the country, they called on the Federal Capital Territory Administration to expedient actions to address the challenges faced by farmers for Nigeria to meet up with the Sustainable Development Goal of Zero Hunger by 2030 and for the Federal Capital Territory to play its part toward food sufficiency. Experts say adequate and timely budgetary allocation is required with specific specific attention given to smallholder women farmers. Small scale women farmers organization demand immediate action to address the identified challenges and concerns through the following timely approval of timely approval and release of fund budgeted for agriculture and ensuring January to December budget circle as obtained in the federal and state budgets. Strengthening collaborations with relevant stakeholders, which include civil society organizations, women group, and agricultural association, to ensure the effective implementation of agricultural programs. Also help to facilitate the provision of affordable credit and financial service tailored to the unique needs of smallholders, women farmers, to enable them invest in their farming activities and improve their productive capacity and overall economic well-being. As committed citizens of Nigeria and as a group, we remain confident in the capacity and ability of Nigeria and FCT especially to feed itself and other nations of the world. SOFON stands ready to collaborate with the FCTA, civil society organizations, and other stakeholders to advocate for the rights and welfare of small older women farmers. Hello, hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.